morning, friends. It's early here. My husband got up about 3.30, and he was making some racket. Not on purpose, but woke me up, and I've been up a while. So, it's now about 6.30 here in this little West Texas town. And I thought I would come in here and see if I could pull a video together for you guys. Because I need a little help. I need some advice. We're back to this corner to corner blanket. And I want to show you what I'm concerned about. And if anybody is watching this video that has made these blankets before, I need some advice. So I'm going to show you. I don't know how come they got uneven. I'm going to show you how I've started decreasing. And you look at this, if if you can, just from this video. And maybe can tell me, am I doing this right? Because they're not even. So I've got it the, the, the size I want it. And I decrease it. Now, <clears throat> this is the corner, the... Uh, where I stopped, I'm sorry, is where I stopped and started decreasing. So this is one side, and this is the other side, and they're uneven. So I don't know if as I go, it'll all come together over here, or if I've really messed up and I need to rip out. I don't know. I've never done it before. So if you could, anybody, give me a little advice. I'm going to keep going and see what happens, but if if you can tell me if this is wrong, I'll just rip out to where I started decreasing and do it again. <clears throat> Excuse me. I'm not new to ripping out and frogging back. But anyway, good morning. Coffee? Hubby made my coffee this morning. Mm. The coffee pot went off and... I got me another half a cup, and it wasn't real hot, so I put it in the microwave, and I might have overdone it a little bit. So, okay, well, otherwise, I'm going to keep it going. And I have a color picked out for a border on this. It's a Crafter Secret, and it's a Dark Ivory. Now, that is a different weight yarn, but I think on a border it'll still work out what do you guys think will that work i'm gonna give it a go unless i hear otherwise my uh, videos are getting a little bit better i'm learning a little bit more about it as we go i wanted to show you my workspace here this is kind of where i sit it's my yeah, I see my crackers over there for a snack. I like Ritz crackers. I have too many of them, I think. But this is kind of my corner in this room. I've got some paintings over here that I'm going to talk about. So let me just start telling you about my paintings. Let me turn it back around here. I don't know how bad that did, but... Guess I'll see it when I view it again. Uh, it's going on fall, so I wanted to show you some of my fall paintings. Now, these paintings, I used to do acrylics for a few years, and that was before we moved here out to West Texas. And after I did my share of them, I realized I don't really have much talent. Oh, I can copy stuff, and you know, watch something and copy it, but I, it lacks all the little artistic detail that comes with having some talent. So I gave it up because, well, I'll let somebody else do that. This is my pumpkin painting. Now, the border, I got some ideas from this on uh, Pinterest. And the pumpkins, now those are, it. the pumpkins, I got the idea on Pinterest, but I just did these myself. I didn't copy. The eyes, I went on Google and typed in uh, goofy eyes or 
strange eyes or something. So I got ideas from that. But I like this pumpkin pumpkin painting. <clears throat> That's my pumpkin. I think this is one of those fly traps. I'm not sure <laughs> it's beautiful. But it's supposed to be what Venus fly trap. That's what they're called. <laughs> this is just a weird little Halloween painting. That This was a tutorial off the internet from, I can't remember her name, the Art Sherpa or something like that, where she talks about paints and kind of gives it a little tutorial. And I kind of followed along with this one. So, it did, Venus flytrap. <laughs> yeah, right. Okay. Now, this one... This one is called Spooky Train. And this was easy and fun. And this was another tutorial from a lady on the internet. It was fun, but <laughs> it's lacking a few things. And then, these are my Dancing Witches. Another tutorial on the internet. And, I don't know, it was fun. It was easy. That was fun. So those, those are my Halloween paintings. <laughs> anyway, I wanted to share those with you guys. And, uh, today, I was supposed to go with my sister-in-law to Lubbock to pick up her computer at Best Buy. But with all the furniture moving yesterday, yeah, we're rearranging our living room. With all the furniture moving... I think I've strained my back a little, and I might not go. So, I might be staying home this trip. So, that was the plan today. Yeah, we're rearranging the living room. Because we've got to move the big screen TV away from the fireplace. Because fall is right around the corner, and we want to be able to use it. We've never used it since we, we've been here. But I think this, this winter will be the winter to start using our fireplace so okay gang well this is it's not much but i did need some advice about this corner to corner blanket and i kind of wanted to show you a little piece of my space around here and some of my paintings so all right guys so hope to catch you next time and i hope everybody has a blessed day and god bless everyone okay bye for now <laughs>